Yo, what's going on everybody? It's your boy iPod King Carter here. I want to welcome y'all to a new video. Today we're going to be talking about NBA 2K21 cross-platform. Yeah, yeah. I want to dive into cross-play because I don't see why 2K just hasn't done it yet. But before we hop into that, man, I want to talk to you guys about the little bit of news that have been dropping on NBA 2K's TikTok. Uh, like I told you guys in my last video, it looks like 2K wants to grow their TikTok social media because TikTok is one of the growing fastest platforms out right now. So, I mean, if you're not on TikTok like me, um, yeah, you're kind of losing because you could kind of blow up. Yeah. Um, but yeah, back to what I was talking about. Um, today we got super trolled by Mike Wang. Um, basically he was talking about booting times for 2K. He was on his TikTok uh and literally said, This is NBA 2K21 and did this. I literally like Thanos, come on. Um, that didn't really like get me going, but I thought I was gonna see a booting screen when he tweeted it out. So I did get baited into that tweet but before then 2k did show that they were mo-capping new dunk animations ah! which means slashers are oh yeah, um, I'm thinking that Slashers will be back for another year for NBA 2K21. Me, myself, I've been a Slasher for a few years now. Um, I've been one of those people that like to attack the basket. And the meta this year for NBA 2K20 was just that. Everybody loved to attack the rim. And, of course, they had builds out there that could do just about everything. But Slashing was literally insane. Also... new face scans it looks like 2k will have i don't know if it's new technology or better cameras this time around for their face scans but i can say that a lot of new players will be getting scanned into nba 2k21 so there's that all right so let's hop into what i want to talk about today now crossplay it is something that everyone is talking about it's literally the leading thing in the gaming industry right now people yeah we talk about console wars and we talk about the the um lead pc race and stuff like that like everybody wants to have the best biggest pc out there everybody wants to have the console war of what is better xbox over playstation but as far as being a fan of nba 2k and their franchise not a lot of people are talking about crossplay, and i don't know why literally i told you guys this last year 2k nba whatever you know what i think it's like nba 2k playgrounds 2 that should be the official name of the game is cross platform the only platform that is not involved in the cross play is ps4 all right now i remember that a lot of people said that sony was having an issue they didn't really want to do cross play they thought that all they needed was themselves and their actual you know ps and servers and stuff like that and they didn't want to cross play with anybody else but those things changed over time now um nba 2k playgrounds 2 is cross play on pc nintendo switch and xbox one okay now let's talk about nba 2k like the the actual simulation basketball franchise let's talk about nba 2k21 now let's talk about that for this current generation let's talk about ps4 xbox one and nintendo switch and pc for a moment now don't get me wrong i may be jumping all the way out of the window with this one but i would never ever say let's bring pc to cross platform i'm sorry i'm sorry PC is riddled, infested with hackers, exploiters. Listen, I would never, ever say, hey, PC community, come on over. I want to play you. Hell no, I do not want to be playing hackers all day long. Don't get me wrong. Some of the hackers do be bad. They're terrible at the game. They just love modding and exploiting and hacking the game. But it's just not realistic. You shouldn't be pulling up on twos playing against a 50 foot player and you're not used to that. You know what I'm saying? You ain't you ain't come with them hacks and your automatic legend got all the badges in the game on Hall of Fame and you got your arms is all the way out hitting. That's just not realistic. So PC, we love you, but you're going to stay your ass over there. 
Now let's talk about PS4, Xbox One, and Nintendo Switch. I believe, in all honesty, that NBA 2K21 for this current generation should start to cross play, man. Like start it up, get get the people going because you wanna know what's so funny, guys? I have two consoles. I'm not gonna go over there and pick them up. I know that's what y'all want me to do. Y'all want me to rip out all them cores out of the Xbox, all the cores out of the PS4 and show you that I got two consoles. Y'all know I have two consoles, but the problem is there's a, there's a, there's a gap. All the, I'm sorry for hitting the mic. All the celebrities that I know play on xbox i don't know why i don't know if it's like a not a secret illuminati thing but i think there's something that happens when a rapper a actor slash actress uh a, a r&b artist a model uh i believe there's some type of like i don't know induction to the gaming community like i think that there's just some secret like i don't know if it's like a a team from Microsoft that just be holding Xboxes and as soon as somebody get famous they're like here goes your Xbox welcome to gaming I don't I don't know it's 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 beyond me like every person that I know the game Snoop freaking uh who else um I know party party has an xbox it's just like for some reason all these artists is like they have xbox i don't know what it is bro it's like it's like literally microsoft just be sitting in the cut and as soon as somebody get popular here's the xbox use that it's beautiful like i don't know i don't know but on the side of playstation i feel like that's where all the competition is at that's why i feel like all the great players come from from PlayStation. I, I believe that since PlayStation is the cheaper console and it's been like that for years now, they always have the bigger player base. They always have the more competitive players. And don't get me wrong, they have a lot of trash players as well, which a lot of people pick on. But for the most part, those same players that may have been trash get a lot better because they keep playing stiff competition. Also, I've seen plenty of Pro-Am teams them dudes on PlayStation different. Don't get me wrong, Xbox, y'all ain't y'all ain't slouches either. But it's just not that many of y'all. As far as like real, real competitive players, they're all they, they do have some on Xbox, but it's not a huge pool of competitor players. That's it's just not. I don't know why, but it's just not. If you ever notice like Xbox YouTubers that play 2K, some of the time they're playing a lot of the same people. And I mean a lot of the same people. But when you see the same people playing on PlayStation, you're like, dog, it's a lot of people on PlayStation. Like literally Ticino, he hasn't even played one fourth of the community yet. And he's played a ton of people in wagers. Just think about it. Like Ticino has played so many people yet has barely scratched the surface on the, the PlayStation community as far as comp goes, because there's so many, there's so many uh, teams out there. There's so many crews and so many pro-am teams that want to play twos. Like it's a lot, you know what I mean? So I just believe that with cross play, we can make magic happen because I, I've seen so many comments saying, why don't you come to Xbox? PSN is trash. And I've seen comments where PSN people clap back. What you mean we trash? We way better than y'all over here. So why not bring in crossplay to even it all out? You know what I'm saying? Start bringing these more wagers up. PlayStation versus Xbox. You know what I'm saying? It won't matter what platform you on. It only matter what server you on. You know what I mean? Because I've seen players uh wager in eu i've seen a wager in the asian servers i've seen a wager in west i've seen a wager in east you know what i'm saying so why not bring the other platforms in to make the player pool a lot better you know what i'm saying give people more uh i would say more reach to more players because there's a lot of xbox players out there that are playing on this, um the threes and the twos and can't get a game people just running you know what i'm saying they 80 90 even 99 over i've seen people that are all star three 99 overall not get a game for 25 minutes i've seen elite ones 40 minutes elite threes 60 minutes i've seen a legend sit on the spot for over an hour on xbox waiting for a game because he didn't have a logo so 
all I'm saying is cross play would make the most sense to bring the player bases together to get more games and plus 2k think about it it will generate not only more play time on your game possibly more income for you guys because more consoles will get sold more people will generate to the console of their choice that they actually want to play on because they they get one console only because their friends got it imagine being able to play with an xbox controller you know what i mean now don't get me wrong there are people that ha that do that now that have playstations that play with xbox controllers have xboxes that play with playstation controllers but it's too much stuff that you got to do you know what i mean imagine all the people that's on playstation right now that that came from xbox that hate blue screens that say they don't want to deal with blue screens well, guess what? They can go to Xbox One, not have to worry about blue screens, and play against their friends. Because don't get me wrong, we already know the blue screens is coming. Right, 2K? You know what I'm saying? I believe that's a console problem. I don't believe it's a 2K problem. I believe the blue screen is a, is a console problem. You know what I'm saying? So it's something up with the PS4. Now, let's step into next generation. PlayStation 5. Xbox um, Series X. They should have cross-play. Period. Nintendo Switch, you guys can come in too. You can get your ass whooped. You know what I'm saying? Don't get me wrong. I've seen a couple uh Nintendo Switch players. They're pretty good. Don't get me wrong. Nintendo Switch NBA 2K isn't that bad. I thought I think the last Switch uh NBA 2K that I played was 2K18 until I did a St. Jude uh charity event and I played NBA 2K20 on the Switch. It wasn't that bad. It wasn't that bad at all. So Switch, you guys can come over too. But PC, I love y'all. But 2K ain't never going to put no anti-cheat in the game. And I'm sorry, y'all just going to have to stay over there. PC, I love you. Because the mods and the, and, and the exploits and everything that you could do within the PC realm is amazing. And I would never want to bring you guys the anti-cheat. I don't want that to happen for y'all. I want y'all to keep having the most fun and live your best life. You know what I mean? I know there's a lot of people in the PC community that just want to have fun. They just literally want to have fun. They don't want to be confined to doing things because 2K has all these certain rules and stuff like that. Like um, one thing, for instance, right? I've been on PC on uh, NBA 2K20. You can wear championship rings from any team. 2K is literally holding back certain merchandise and clothing and stuff like that. Like you could be, you could be a real police officer in 2K. Like with the with the actual police officer clothing, not a shirt, not a, not some bullcrap joggers. I'm talking about official gear. Check check out my homie Trey channel. He got plenty of mods out there with certain clothes on and gear, like real firefighters, all kinds of stuff. That's in 2K20 right now. So when 2K21 comes out, I still want the PC community to have fun, do what they do, play up against hackers all day, have fun, see 50 feet, 50 feet people um 10 foot long arms and stuff like that have all the fun you want but i don't want y'all on cross play because i don't want the anti-cheat to come to pc i feel like i have the most fun um on pc as far as content goes and watching that content opposed to watching console content because console content is nothing but competitive just straight up just people just fixed in for the win where pc like watching trade videos and other YouTubers that have went over to PC and done videos, those videos are much more funny and entertaining than just watching people on console be competitive the entire time. You know what I mean? Like, and plus with me having an 81 percentage in both rec and park, I know that being competitive is just a console mindset. You don't want to lose ever on PC. I take the loss. Oh, he had 110 attributes. What do you want me to do? He had every hall of fame badge in the game. Like literally every single badge on hall of fame in the game. <laughs> and he was a legend. It's nothing that you can do with 110 plus attributes. <laughs> Insane dog. But look, man, Crossplay needs to come to NBA 2K21 this gen and next gen. I'm stamping that. Also, for everybody that left a comment about what console you're on, the like, the dislike, all that, appreciate you guys, man. Every little bit just counts, but I'm out of here. I've held you guys up for too long. Um, also, one last thing. Will you guys be getting a digital version or a disc version of either console when the next gen consoles come out. Let me know that inside the comment section. I'll see you guys in the next one. This is your boy IKC signing out. Bye.